And that leads us to the fact, and the fact is this, real Christians are constantly being told the truth. Real Christians are constantly being told the truth. Jesus says in John 16, 13, the spirit of truth will guide you into all truth. So what's happening there? The scripture there is describing that as you're going throughout your day and you're starting to go to a lie, you're starting to believe a lie, the Holy Spirit will say, if you're truly saved, the Holy Spirit says, no, that's a lie, don't go there, go this way. And he will guide you to live in the truth. The Holy Spirit's job is all day long with Jennifer to whisper into her mind, whisper into heart the truth so that she lives in the truth, the truth about herself, the truth about others. You see, once we become Christians, the Spirit of God works in us telling us the truth. Why? Because 3 John 4 says this, nothing makes God happier than to hear his children live in the truth. So here's my question for you. Are you living in the truth today? Are you living in the truth about love? Are you living in the truth about yourself? Are you living in the truth about yourself? Because Romans 12, 3 says this, don't think you're better than you really are. Be honest in your evaluation of yourself. And so he said, hey, does your heart reflect what you say? By the way, are you living in the truth about your mouth? Are you living in the truth about your waistline? Are you living in the truth about your relationships, your finances, your job? Are you seeing them the way Jesus sees them? But not only do we need to live in the truth about ourselves, are you living in the truth about others? Ephesians 4.15 says this, God wants you to grow up. God wants us to grow up, to know the whole truth and to tell it in love. What's it mean? It means this, if Paul's going to be a mature Christian, then he's got to be honest about his wife and kids. Are you honest about the people in your life? Here's how I know. The Bible says, look at what he said, Ephesians 4.15. God wants us to grow up to know the whole truth and what? Tell it in love. Are you telling the people in your life the truth in love? Living in the truth means I'm honest about my children, what knuckleheads they are. I'm honest about the people in my life. But not only am I honest about it, I'm sharing that honesty. I'm sharing that truth in love. By the way, I can always tell when I'm counseling a Christian. Because when I'm counseling a Christian, I never tell them something that the Holy Spirit hadn't told them already. You know what I'm talking about? You go to somebody, you seek their counsel, and they give you biblical counsel, and the whole time you're going, yeah, God's been telling me that in my gut for a while. I just didn't want to hear it out loud. Right? That's proving that you're a, you're a Christian. Why? Because the Spirit has told you the truth. You just haven't done anything with it. 